Hi everyone, this is Jane here from Crystal Sparkles Readings. I'm just here to pop down a card for the day for us. So I'm just going to have a little shuffle of the Faulkner deck as usual. Have a little look and see what the tarot's got to tell us today. Okay, let's have a little look and see what we've got. I'm just going to pick a couple up that I've dropped on the floor. Let's just have a shuffle again. And see what we've got. Okay, so card I have for today is the lovely six of wands now the six of wands in the tarot is a fantastic card it's all about success um it's all about success and victory and getting what you want so it's a work card sometimes um quite frequently because it's a wands card so they often talk about work projects things that we're doing um action that we're taking so any action that you might be taking today um looks like it has a successful outcome so <clears throat> it's a really really positive energy six of wands is um a really really great card when it comes to things like interviews um you know job interviews job um asking about any kind of business propositions all that kind of thing um when it comes to love um the wands cards are great when they transfer over to love because they often talk about positive action being taken to make things happen and quite often when we're doing love readings for people um or in general um the the energy that the person has when they're coming to us is quite stuck and you know what do i do about this and is this thing ever going to move forward so the six of wands is saying that we've got positive movement forward. So we're going forward and it's in a positive direction. So love wise, if anything's been a bit stuck, it can mean that we're moving forward with that and we, we're kind of taking positive action. So if there's something that you're thinking, should I do this? Do it. This card is saying, yes, 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 go for it. OK, so in a, in the um, in the energy of a card for day, I would say the Six of Wands is saying, if there's anything that you need to do, go get it done. Um, if there's anything that you're looking to push forward with, do push forward to take action. This is an action card. So it's not a day for take, you know doing nothing or just going, right, okay, I'm going to leave that for now. Get it done. It's, it's all good. If you can kind of motor on through, um, make it happen. If you do that, you will be successful this card talks about success it's about victory it's about making something happen solving problems and all of that kind of stuff so it's a really great energy for the day um really really important to stay in that positive energy so i'm just going to have a little shuffle of the energy oracle deck and put down a little oracle card for us as well to go with this and we'll see what we've got to go with this in that you know energy oracle card so let's see what we've got here ah oh, lovely so this is the temple path um the temple path to me is talking about your own spiritual journey okay so you're moving towards where you want to go spiritually where you feel like your destiny is um it's all about you being able to kind of um well, you can see there's the path is lit for you. There, there are going to be signs and spirit are going to help you. Um, you know, I always get really drawn to the spiral of this. Um, it just I love this. I love this card. It's um, it's very reminiscent of, of things like they used to have in like big manor houses with, with loads and loads of land. They'd quite often have a folly. And the folly might be like a little temple or like a little castle or a little tower or something. And to me, um, I'm a bit of a bit of an old romantic, really. Um, and it would have been um, it would have been saying, uh, you know, sort of 
these these little areas are, are where um you know lovers trysts took place meetings secret meetings and you know where where lovers met where they didn't want everybody else to see hi there on periscope thank you for joining me um so yeah so the temple path talks to me it's quite often about love and it's about your spiritual path it's about your um route to your destiny um as you can see the the lights around the temple are kind of guiding you in they're, they're giving you something to aim at somewhere to work towards hi what's your question I'm not doing personal readings on here just to let you know it's um it's just a general reading for everybody for the day um I do do private readings you're more than welcome to contact me direct if that's what you would like um but I don't do personal readings on here if you have a general question happy to answer that um okay no problem what is your question So, yeah, the Temple Path is a very, very spiritual card. I really love it. Um, and Six of Wands and the Temple Path together seem to be suggesting that we're moving forward in the right direction and that we are going to be um, kind of reaching our destiny today, getting to where we want to be and where we want to go. Um, so it's a really lovely... Um, gentle energy that leads us to where we want to be um sorry i'm just um i've just got a few people being silly on periscope so just needed to block them for a second um so yeah that's where we are with the reading six of wands very very good energy um very positive get things done go for it temple path follow your spiritual destiny so follow your own route know where you're going know what your heart desires just follow that spiritual path we all have that inner knowing within us and sometimes we kind of get a little bit bogged down and we lose sight of that a little bit the temple path says stay on your spiritual path um so i will leave that with you for today thank you very much for tuning in thanks for tuning in on periscope and thanks for watching on youtube um for those that are watching on youtube this is a um I take this broadcast that I do on Periscope and I upload it onto my YouTube video. So if every now and again you hear me answering a question, it's because someone on Periscope has asked. Um, sometimes I have to stop and block people because you get people that are, you know, sort of, you know, what they're like um, coming on and being rude or just, you know, being generally disruptive to what you're doing. Um, so I'm really sorry if that sort of has got in the way of today's video. Um, I might actually consider just doing these videos specifically for YouTube if that continues on to be a problem on Periscope. It's not usually the case. Um, sometimes you do get the odd idiot or two. Um, I will leave that with you for now. Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back again tomorrow. Bye for now.